My name is Jonathan Miles. I am the uh, supervisor at the Quit Line. The Quit Line is a tobacco cessation program uh, that came into existence in 2002, and we are helping people with tobacco addiction uh, to get rid of that addiction, to work with it, and learn how to taper off of tobacco dependency. The, uh, the way that the Colorado Quit Line works in particular is that you can join us via the phone. You can join uh, a web service program that we have. Um, and you technically, you just call in to our Quit Line. Uh, uh, and then our call takers take your information. Uh, they do an intake with you, the same that you would normally do at, at, at a hospital. Uh, instead of them handing you the paper, we're just verbally asking you the questions and filling it in for you to build your profile. When we're done, then we transfer you over to what we call a tobacco cessation quit coach, which is a counselor. And then they start working on your program with you. The average length of time for the program itself uh, varies from five weeks to 10 weeks. Uh, the addiction is very hard to, to break. Uh, it, it's as known it's known that it's as difficult to stop smoking or using tobacco products as it is uh, heroin. So, yes, some people literally can go through within five weeks and break their addiction if they're diligent and follow the program steps and are ready to quit. But if you're not really ready to quit, what we will also do is help you with your um, relapse issues and withdrawal symptoms and give you information. So as you go down the path of breaking your addiction, that you can actually have the tools of helping yourself without us. It's constantly shown that all the health issues that the black community has, tobacco and menthol is one of the major ones um, because we already know it's bad for you. And, but it's, it, it's prevalent, it, it's said, it, it's a stereotype actually to use menthol. Um, we hear it at the quit line actually, because one of the questions that we ask you when we ask you about your tobacco use and you say you use cigarettes, we actually ask you, are they menthol or non-menthol? And you, the, the <laughs> people get indignant about not using menthol. Like, I, I never use that. They, they actually get offended <laughs> if you ask them and that they might use it because they don't use menthol. That's for other people. And it's like, okay, who are those other people in your mind is what you're running. Like, I know who the other people are. They're, they're saying those are what black people use because that's what's the push is. Black people use menthol. They're the ones that if you go in there, there's certain brands that have different color cigarettes, packages, red for normal, green for menthol. Quit. The black community just has to learn to to trust us and we have to earn that trust. Uh, we're not going to sell your information to anybody, but your information can go to insurance companies. They can go to businesses. They can go to your, your job. If your job, someone's sponsoring it and you're going through your work to us, we do do that um, if they request, but we don't give them your health records. We don't give them the information. People who are struggling with quitting who, who are looking for help, I would say, call us and talk to us. We'll, we'll gladly tell you about our program and never force you to join. We understand the first portion of getting people off of tobacco products and this addiction and, and definitely breaking you of the menthol use is information. If you have the information, then 
the rest of this is about your desire to quit. If your desire is to quit, we're here for you. It's going to work. Now, it may not work right away, but it's going to work if that's your true desire. Yeah, you can get in touch with the quit line by calling uh, 1-800-784-8669. That's the actual number that you can call the quit line. Uh, you can go online and look up the uh, quit line. I believe it's quitline.org. You can try that. Each state should have its own quit line services. Uh, you can look up, you can go on Google and just look up tobacco addictions. Um, you can look up sensation programs and literally the quit line will pop up. Please go online and, and read, uh, what the information is there. And if you're open to it, we're here to help. And like I said earlier, we don't judge you. We, we are just here to help you down that path of getting rid of the addiction to uh, tobacco and you know we'll give you as much information as we can and if you're receptive to us we will definitely support you through this